video to take screenshot of screen of cable fault locator onto the computer test p1 file is given onto the cd download it to your computer once test p1 has been installed onto the computer double click and you will see a test.exe file click on test.exe please note the rs232 to usb should be connected to com1 to com9 of the computer here we have connected to com1 enter 1 from the key keyboard press enter wait for 2 seconds press enter again you are given an option please read the options at this time connect the rs232 to the equipment and turn it on as you can see the menu is been printed here on the screen if you want to take a screenshot of the menu as mentioned on the screen press the left arrow button on the keypad here press the left arrow button on the keypad now it will ask you for a file name i will type it as screen please note you have to give the extension .bmp please note .bmp extension has to be given in the screen file name ok after that please press enter in the same test p1 folder you will see the screen.bmp file being created double click on this you will see the screenshot of the screen in your computer to take the screenshot of the waveform again click on test p1 go to test.exe and open the file enter the port number 1 we have connected to port number 1 please note in your equip in your computer you can connect anywhere between from port number 1 to port number 9 please enter the port to which you have connected onto the screen here press enter press enter again now if you want the screenshot of the waveform you have to press press select key and then the left arrow button so we have this screen here we will press first select and then left arrow button i will name this as wave dot bmp please note bmp is important you cannot miss that enter So, you can see the screenshot of the waveform that is on the screen of the equipment. This is how you save the screenshot of the screen onto your computer. This can be used further for taking printouts. Thank you.